Okay, we got this little SkyTech quadcopter. A small little guy. I'll try him out. It's got a light on the front of it. Now this light can be really easily confused by people to think that this is a camera. Uh, but that's just a little LED light. There's no camera on this quadcopter. It's really cheap though. It's 26 bucks. So let's see uh, how she flies. Bind the quadcopter. Set the trim. Okay. All right. It's immediately wanting to fly kind of forward on me. I'm fighting it back. Really responsive. Seems to have a lot of power. I may try to attach a run cam to it and see how it does. See for range. Right down a little fast there. Oh, yeah, when it starts coming down, and this thing really wants to come down fast. So, it's kind of a heavy plastic. The housing to kind of emulate the DJI quadcopters but uh I think that's what's making it fall so fast let me turn it off and see what kind of weight it'll carry okay so I want to start by saying I have no belief that this thing is going to carry this run cam <laughs> I'm not uh, <laughs> I have no illusions delusions that this will pick this run cam up but I am a little curious as what's going to happen. It's just mounted there with a little bit of hook and loop. And it's full out nothing. Now, everybody who, who flies quadcopters should really get a mini or two. They're cheap. This one was like 26 bucks, and it really gives you a lot of time to practice with your maneuvers, with the different things that you need to really get pretty good at using these quadcopters. Like just then, where I, I turned my orientation back around to match where I changed the sides with it. You really need to get good at that. I'm hearing a beeping sound, which means oh, that might have been a bird, actually. Trying to get it down to me. Man, when it falls, it falls fast. You gotta be careful. Gosh, and then it raises fast too, jeez. Ugh, I knew it. So, it's a really good quad. I really like it. Now, the, the things I have against it, I think it's because they made this frame so heavy duty that I don't like the fact that when it falls, it falls. And it falls fast. It's hard to fight against it. And that's seen that, I've seen that happen a lot with my bigger quad coppers when I put a lot of weight on them, is that the momentum of the falling really takes a hold. I like my quad coppers to be a little more stable in the air where you can ease them down a little easier. All in all though, I really like it. For 26 bucks, I'm not complaining. 